Hey everyone, Ash and I are back in my shop today. My daughter Avery is in college right now. She's at home and working. And she came to me and said, I am tired of sitting in my bed with my computer. So she asked me to build her a desk. So today we're building her this DIY waterfall writing desk that we built for $100. Come build it with us. bird really is loud. All right, okay, so we are gonna get started on this. Now, I have already gone and ripped. Do y'all hear how loud the bird is? Is that a so problem? Loud. Go! Go! All right, so we've already got our wood ripped down to three inches wide each. These are two by fours that I've cut down. I actually bought two by sixes because they were a lot nicer and they didn't cost that much more and I saved the other part of it. So I prefer two by six. I do. They look better and they're easier to find looking nice. So these are cut at a 45 degree angle and we are using our Craig 720 Pro to make one and a half inch pocket holes on all of our 45 degree ends. You can see these are gonna go in at an angle and into our other board, and then you won't see the screws. We do get lots of questions about that though, like with a 45 degree angle, how do I put my pocket holes in? And now you know, guys. Okay, so Whitney got all of the pocket holes drilled, and I am going to attach the pieces together to create the frame. This is the front, so we're gonna make the pocket holes face the inside, so they'll face up right now. And we're using two and a half inch pocket hole screws with a little bit of wood glue. And a whole lot of luck. And a whole lot of love. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna do the same thing over here. And what we're doing is we're creating the frame, the front frame, there's gonna be two of them, front and back, of this waterfall desk. Don't zoom in on my nail, please, Jeffrey. Like, she's like super fortunate that I'm her mom. That's all. I agree. So we have one of our frames done. It doesn't look like much now, but just wait, guys. All right, guys, our next step is going to be to add the top of our desk. Now, we're using um, laminated pine board. Yeah. Sometimes, it, sometimes it's called edge glued panel. There, that's another word for it. Um, but these are typically on your, like, uh, one by aisle, and they're a lot less expensive than plywood right now. A so. lot of times they're with the circles, the cut yes. circles. Yeah, too. and they're already ready to go. Um, and I actually think they stain so pretty, too. They do. So um, if you want to or actually do this so they can watch the glue being put on. So I'm adding just a very thin, or not very, at all. Very, very thin. <laughs> so thin you can't see it. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, and now it's like so thick. <laughs> <laughs> so what we're doing now, guys, is we are going through this. Well, Ashley, my wonderful clamping sister, um, we are going to go and add our pocket hole screws. These are one and a quarter inch with our wood glue. So now I'm gonna add one of our sides. This is also gonna be that same kind of laminated pine board, and I'm adding a very large, but supposed to be small line of glue down that frame. And then I'm putting it in place. Now this we also cut using the miter saw to a 45 degree angle, if you can see. And so that's gonna line up with our top. And I am gonna add a few nails in that at the end because Avery doesn't care about nail holes. And then I'm gonna ask my lovely assistant, Ashley. Ashley, would you come hold it, please? Make yourself useful. Make myself a little useful. Yeah. We've got one side attached. Now we're gonna attach the other side and we are going to run a thin line of glue down the edge. Ooh, that made a sound. It almost sounded like you tooted. Huh? Well. <laughs> And then we're gonna put a little right there. Ash is a little gassy this morning. Sorry. Bacon gouda. <laughs> Bacon gouda. She actually had a ham and I Swiss ham baguette. And Swiss. <laughs> it was the baguette that did it. <laughs> She's gotta stay away from that uh, <laughs> gluten. The gluten. <laughs> does it does every time. <laughs> gluten gets you tootin'. <laughs> Make the sound. Gluten get you to Okay, shut up! Okay, I'm, I'm doing the first one on that side, okay? 
Like butter. Noise. Noise. Okay, so at this point, we have what, almost the carcass, right? Yeah, this is almost the carcass. the carcass. So now we're gonna go and add our little spacers. I'm th making sure this is the step that I wanna do first. We're gonna add our little spacers next. So I have those. So now we're adding our spacers. I just cut some three inch little scraps off of um, one of the boards. And these are gonna go inside of each piece and I'm just gluing them and nailing them. <laughs> Came out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> and just, like, just like that. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna nail these in place. I got one side. I'll do the next one. And what these are doing is creating that thickness because we're giving this desk the overall look that it's like thick and chunky when actually it's not. And I want to make sure that I'm avoiding all of my pocket holes because we still have to be able to access those when we put on our other frame. What I'm doing now, because we just kind of spaced our spacers um, instead of actually measuring them out, but I am going to go just quickly mark. <laughs> oh, gross, sorry. I have a lot of dog hair and I webs. Put it on you when you were talking. <laughs> She's so annoying. Spacers, spacers, um, instead of actually measuring them out. But I okay, I'm going to, I'm scarred by them too because I spent all day cleaning them. Um, I'm just marking, just quickly kind of showing myself where those are going to line up because when we go out our inside pieces, we, we need to know where to nail. So. Now we won't forget. We don't have to have x-ray vision now, so. Absolutely, which is the goal. All right, so now what we're gonna do is take this bad boy down, and, cause I think that's the best way, right? And then put the top frame down and put this on top of it to put in the rest of yeah. our pocket holes. Okay, Sweet. you're strong, you work out, pull it towards you. <laughs> yeah. Look at her go, <laughs> Do you see how it will be cute though? Yes, I love okay. it. Okay, it will be cute. So now we're just lining it up, and Ash will do gloomy. Ash is gonna add a little line of glue all the way around. All right, we've got our first pocket hole screw in and I'm just gonna go all the way around and get these pocket hole screws attached to the frame. Um, so here I go. The final step Can after I- Can I say I've it? I wanna say this is the last yeah. step. <laughs> yes. Okay. This is the last step. <laughs> so, <laughs> now that I've fixed all of my mistakes, we are going to add the, the is that the piece of resistance one? Yes, we're gonna add that. So we are going to add these on the inside where our support boards are, and that's just going to give us a nice thick, I've already done it on this side, as you can see, gives us a nice, thick, chunky looking desk, which is what she wanted. So, Ash, I'm gonna let you do the glue. Put this chick to work. You did a really good job on that. I've done it a few times. And we're gonna <clears throat> say a little prayer that this guy slides right in. Right for you. Okay. And then, like I said, we've, oh, hide that now. <laughs> we've marked where our support boards are. And I'm just going back through with the brad nailer. There was probably a way to design this without the nails, but. I think it's great. Thanks. You just saying that because it's done. How would you know, honestly? I know. You have to have nails. I mean, unless you're a male woodworker that does the biscuits and the all dovetails. That. Yeah. But, you know, that we're, we're, we're girls. <laughs> we can't do we're stuff noobs. like that. We're just moms. Okay, guys, we are finished with Avery's waterfall. I'm gonna move stuff so we can So I just wanna show the ends of these tables, like how it's designed. I think it's so smart because she used scraps to haul it leave it hollow and it's less expensive, but it still gives the same chunky look. So I built the entire desk for under $100 too. I don't think you could get one at Ikea for $100. I, oh, for sure not, not right now. I love how this desk turned out. I just have to give it a few coats of stain. She's already put in a request, of course, of what stain color she wants. Well, then you don't have to think about it. That is true, No, that makes it easy. So I've gotta get that done. And then I told her she's gotta decorate the whole thing and take a picture for me. She did such a good job decorating it. I love how it looks in her room and it gives her the perfect spot for her laptop so she can get all of her work done. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss another video. Happy, Happy building. building. Hi guys. So I don't like saying hi guys. Hey everyone, right? What's up? What up guys? Okay, what's up guys? Welcome to our YouTube channel. <laughs> Sorry, we'll just talk through it. And so today we built her this super cute waterfall Desk. Writing desk for her computer writing. to sit. Yeah, writing. writing. Well, 
Well, because when I hear writing, it sounds like I just picture writing a writing words. desk. You're gonna yeah. write your desk. But today, you were gonna say the oh, writing sorry. part because you don't like writing. How I say oh, writing? Sorry. Okay. <laughs> so today we are at Whitney's shop. So today we're at Whitney's house building her daughter this $100 DIY writing desk, DIY waterfall writing desk that you built. <laughs> I would just say writing. Feels okay. Weird, it feels no. very aggressive. <laughs> writing. <laughs> writing. Okay. <laughs> so today, so this is what your pocket holes are going to look like. And actually, I'm going to put one a little bit higher. So don't look at that yet. <laughs> this part. So this is what our pocket holes look like. I'm going to show you on a different one because that one's not very clean. I need to. Yeah. I, I screwed. I screwed this up. Tell them what's next. Um. Hey, I just told you. <laughs> We're gonna have a desk out of this yet. Gluten! <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, oh. hold on. Did you have to toot? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, right there. Hold for toot. <laughs> this is this is so Don't less show, this is sure. so not as funny as we think it is. <laughs> Today's video brought to you by Gluten Free Pasta. Here, now we need to Oh, did you I did it, but I thought I did, and I was overreactive about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs>